welcome to the new episode of pcs practical in this session i am going to discuss about the text function in excel so before to start with the text function i need to require to end, i mean i need a data so i have the reference in word file regarding the text function uh, so i will copy this data and i can paste here yeah i'll remove this question marks and let's just have the look of this question the questions are like merge the surname and the name field see in the data you can see the surname and the name so the first question is merge the surname and the name uh, also place a three space between them then that is using the concat function uh, the next to the surname and the name the functions names are written so through that function you can solve these questions the next is uh, cut the extra space from the column c so whatever the extra space you have add in through the concat function so you have to remove it through the trim function display all the surname in upper case so we have upper uh, formula in for the lower case we have lower formula check whether the name and the surname are same or not so we have the exact function then um, find function find the position of the specific character uh, the left function which display may be the like first few characters like first three characters of surname or the name from the left hand side and the right function from the right hand side and the length function is to find the length of the specific text so let's see first the question uh, will solve let's see how to do it merge the surname and the name and also add a three space between them so i'll select i'll use concat function so from the formula tab we have text function so select the text category function and select concat net so the first which two text you want to concat it and the second is this right so by using this it will join the several text string into one text string so this will shows like sha parish right but the thing is without any space if you want to add a space so you have to use a double quotes and within a double quotes you have to add a three space and then a three cell right the multiple text you can concat see so now there is a text between two text i mean space between two text and both the text are concat the trim function that will remove the extra space from the cell so let's see trim which is the cell c2 it will trim the extra space right so only one space is there then the upper function so like you have to write upper select the function select the text close the bracket enter see that converts it into the upper then we have lower function equals to lower open bracket select cell close bracket enter that converts it into the lower case then the exact function so let's see what is the question Qu question is check whether the name and the surname are same or not okay so what i'm going to do is uh, i'll i'll select this two because sharper sh uh, see there is like two see <laughs> i did is a three 
but it is actually a uh, b2 i thought hmm, now everywhere is shaparish right instead of patel okay previously that concave this two string but i want to concave this two strings right so it automatically change okay everywhere because this is the reference no for all of this so the exact so what i'm going to do is i'll i'll i'll, I'll check uh, this two e and f column and then uh, f and d column let's check whether these two strings are same or not so equals to exact if you forgot the uh, the spelling so you can select from the suggestions uh, this comma this close enter c false similarly if i'll select exact open it this comma this again false because this s and p is capital and these and this is also uh, different but what i'm going to do i'll select copy and paste and let's try again not c3 i want c2 okay now let's change it instead of f2 we'll select d3 d2 and d3 it's true right both the text are same so you'll get result as true and false find mm, find is like find the specific character of the position so find open the bracket select the text right find text within a text so let's say you want to find a comma from this cell you can see the a character that is at third position that's what the result shows right and this for bar shows the formula for this cell the next we have the left function so let's see equals to left it returns the specified number of the character left the text is like 2 comma 2th position which character so from left side you will have uh, first two characters same way the right side equals to r i g h t right and the same text comma two so you will have a h and the length equals to length of this text close bracket press enter oops length of <sighs> length function not length function length and the text close it press enter it's a four the the text length is four right so that is the use of concatenate trim upper lower exact find 
left right and the left function from the text formula category now you can see that um, since you applied the formula you will get the result in the cell but formula bar shows the formula right suppose if you want to check the formula for your whole sheet where you have applied the data so what you will have to do is select the cell range and select show formula right so instead of result now you will have formula in the uh, column in the cell so that is also in formula tab show follow show formula sorry that's it thanks for watching my video we'll meet soon in the next session